Girl Scouts and local VFW present our colors, raise the flag, Thank y'all very much. I want to take the time to thank all of my associates and their families for their hard work and dedication in putting the store together. I would also like to thank our market management team for all the support that they have given to the store. I would also like to thank and introduce the store planning team for their assistance in setting up our store. Our store planning team is right up here in the front. We have Mary, John, Darius, Crystal, Jackie, Shoda, Barbara. We want to thank each and every one of you for all your hard work and dedication. I would also like to thank the construction team that has worked continuously over the past several months to make this store possible. At this time, I'd like to introduce my management team. Without them, none of this would have been possible. So I have Terry Hummel, she's over hard lines. Jacob Tillinghausen, he's over the front end. Vivian Turner is over apparel. Amber Jackson and Megan Clark are on overnights. Kim Johnson is over home lines. Malik is over receiving. Denise Henry is over consumables. Matt Williamson is over fresh. Michael Reynolds is our ACC, our auto care manager. Ben Wilson is our pharmacy manager. And we also have Beth Ferner, who's also one of our pharmacists. And Donna Dyke, she is our vision center manager.
thank you guys again for all your hard work. Um, again, without them, none of this would have been possible. At this time, I'd like to introduce my market manager, Tim Bishop. Hey, good morning, Tim Reveal. So she's got it at times. So really, uh, definitely, definitely want to appreciate the, the, the city of Timberville, the town, uh, Rockingham County for definitely uh, uh, inviting us to the community uh, for this awesome Walmart store. Um, definitely, uh, you know, we had family night on Monday. It was awesome. We had uh, over 100 people here um, for, for family and friend night. And I can tell you, it's a small town. But it's a big spirit here. I can tell you that the, the associates, the families was very excited. Uh, we, was, we had a really good time, so definitely appreciate that. Um, definitely want to appreciate, the, as Angie said, the, the management team here did an outstanding job um, getting this store together. I appreciate store planning, construction, and uh, really want to appreciate the 200 plus associates. Um, our name badge say our people make the difference. And six weeks ago, we walked into a brick building and transformed it into a Walmart store. And all 200 plus associates you made that possible, so thank you very much. Um, and thank you to, to all the customers that's waiting. Um, we're gonna get, get the doors open real soon. Um, but thank you all the vendor partners that's here today. Uh, that also made this possible for us today as well. Um, with that said, I'd like to introduce uh, our regional general manager of the state of Virginia, Mr. Bob Davis. Right, and we'll try this. Good morning, everybody. Good morning, Woo! All right, awesome. Thank you very much. I mean, wow, what a uh, what a privilege and honor it is for us to be here today um, in the community, Timberville, Broadway. You all have really welcomed us with open arms. You know, and uh, um, I, I live outside of Waynesboro, so not too far away. Um, been with the company for 24 years and, and done a lot of these openings. I think this is opening number 25 for me. So, uh, um, you know, we, we, we've been blessed to work for a company um, that's growing, expanding, and we're, we're really, really happy we, we selected this community. You accepted us. I mean, that's the most important thing. I know there was a lot of work that went into the store um, from, 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 the, from the town council, from, from the government, from really the Chamber of Commerce. Everybody's been great, great partners with us. It's always an adventure uh, for me. This is my fifth time here. And uh, um, I got behind, I guess, a, what was a turkey truck. Um, I guess it, it was described as a turkey truck. And, you know, I mean, I know that's commerce. I mean, you know, I'm, I'm really going to have a better day today than those turkeys probably will. Um, so I can't complain too much. But uh, I was coming up a hill behind a turkey truck. And um, what looked like water but smelled like something else hit my car. And, uh, um, you know, I, I, and I grew up in a small town, Bluefield, Virginia, way in the southwestern part of the state. I mean, we had about 8,000 people. I was one of about uh, 280 that graduated, uh, or was in my high school, actually. So, uh, um, you know, I know what it's like to be in a small town, and we really, really appreciate, um, you know, what, what you all um, have done, associates, um, the town. We appreciate, again, for us letting us come here. And then I think most importantly, I mean, you know, Walmart... I, wouldn't, I couldn't get up here without saying a few good things about Walmart. I mean, obviously I'm biased, right? But, you know, whether it was um, a cashier, I would tell a story about one of our people. Started out as a cashier um, as a teenager and uh, worked her way up through the ranks and uh, is now responsible for this store. And her second store, um, Angie, uh, started out as an hourly associate. Tim, our market manager, and we talked about the ACC. Uh, Tim started as an ACC tech, which basically he changed all and, and, and changed tires um, in uh, um, Greenville, North Carolina, and has worked his way up to a position of responsibility to where he's responsible for uh, 10 store or nine stores here in the area. And then myself, I started out as a sales clerk in sporting goods after college. I was trying to, trying to find a job until I, I you know, I had, a, had to have a job until I got my quote unquote real job, and that was 24 years ago. And here I stand in front of you today. I'm in charge of about 100 stores and about 30,000 associates. So I'm going to tell you, associates, you know, a lot of you all are brand new to the company. Some of you are transfers, but your opportunities are really endless with Walmart. And I truly hope one day it's one of you all standing on the stage 
grand opening of store. So and I know that it will be. So uh, with that said, I'm going to turn it back over to Angie. Again, thank you all very much for coming. Uh, we certainly appreciate it. And for the associates, I'm going to leave you with three things. Number one, take care of the customer. Number two, take care of the customer. And number three is? Take care of All right, very good. Thank you very much. And then I would also like to extend a very special thank you to the town of Timberville and all of its residents. Again, without the town council, Chamber of Commerce, Police Department, our fire department, the town office, our local VFW, none of this would be possible. So thank y'all so much for, for having us here and we're ready to serve you. Um, at this time, Mr. Don, our mayor, if you'd like to come up and say a few words. I'm just gonna take a few seconds cause we wanna go here and cut this ribbon, get this thing going. It's been, first of all, before I, before I say anything, is the Walmart employees, I have town employees. I need you to teach them that clap, clap, cheer, cheer thing <laughs> so we can start the council meetings out right from now on. Um, this has been two years in the making. Two years, and I'm telling you, it's been a pleasant experience. Um, the folks at Walmart, Angie, and the construction crew have worked very hard with the town, very, and they've been easy to work with. We had a concern. They addressed it, they took care of it, and, and that's great to see. Um, so, and back, uh, I'd say when we had our first meeting, I don't know, probably some of you there, it was 350 people showed up for our first meeting to discuss Walmart. A historical event for, for um, here, for Timberville, historical. Um, I don't think we'll ever have something this big ever happen in our town, and it's great to have them here. Back then, I talked about how we'll be neighbors before Walmart, we'll be neighbors after Walmart. Well, I'd like to welcome Walmart to our neighborhood. Welcome, guys. Thank you. And last but not least, I want to remember to thank our business partners because as you can see, we have uh, a lot of them out here. We'll have the polar bear. We got Mr. Oreo over there. So we'll have a lot of photo ops. So thank you to all our business partners for getting our store merchandised and for supporting us here on grand opening day. So the last thing that we'll talk about before we do our Walmart cheer and open our doors is our charitable, charitable contributions, our money that we've raised and given uh, to, to this community, the money that'll stay right here in Timberville. Um, Divine Unity Church received $1,000. Plains Elementary School, $2,500. Our Plains Memorial uh, District Museum received $2,500. And our um, town historian, Beverly, is here and our principal from Plains Elementary, Joseph Kapuchuk is here. Uh, we've given $500 to Big Brothers and Big Sisters of Rockingham County, and we have Sue here. <laughs> Shenpeko Industries, we gave $500, and American Red Cross, uh, $500. And then the associates of 6952 Timberville, Virginia have raised over $1,000 for Children's Miracle Network. That $1,000 was raised just during this set. So our, our miracle campaign will be coming up soon and um, we'll be raising more money. And that's also money that'll be close to this community to our local um, Children's Miracle Network Hospital. So thank you guys um, for all your hard work with that. And um, we'll continue to raise more money and keep the money right here in the community. All right, at this time, if I could have all Walmart Associates management, visiting Walmart Associates, please come around the stage. Management team, if you guys could come up on the stage. We're gonna go ahead and do our Walmart cheer, and then we're gonna cut the ribbon. Oh, oh, oh.
right, we're going to get ready to cut the ribbon. If I could have all representatives from the town and the county management team, please head over to the front door so we can get this ribbon cut and open the doors. Thank you. Yeah. 